Good evening, I'm Rick Van Hoos. Just revealed evidence sheds new light on the shooting and wounding of a student at Fern Creek High School back in September. It includes an audio recording of the incident. In a police interview, the 16 year old who is charged tells detectives he shot the wrong teenager. WLKY Steve Bergen joins us now with more on what's in the court file. Steve? Rick, it includes 911 calls, photos, and interviews with both the alleged shooter and the intended target. 911 operator Ebel, where's your emergency? Yes, do you all know there's a shooting at Fern Creek High School? It was September 30th when a gunshot created fear inside Fern Creek High School. One youngster was wounded. The school was evacuated as police swarmed the building searching for the shooter. It's good and bad, all right? The bad is you're going to be charged, okay? Uh, there's no way around that, all right? The good is the guy that you shot, he's okay. 16 year old Andre Banks was questioned by police after he was apprehended at an apartment complex where he fled. 15 year old Javante Burroughs was wounded in the abdomen, but Banks told investigators Burroughs was not the intended target. In this police interview, Banks explained he bought a 22 caliber pistol for $40 weeks earlier and admitted it was not the first time he carried it into the school. You have to go through uh, metal detectors or anything over Fern Creek? Okay. And you had, you had the gun on you at that point when you went into the school? According to Banks, he sold an iPad to a fellow student and received a $100 bill, only to discover it was bogus. That student told police Banks confronted him in the hallway and lifted up his shirt to show he had a gun. And when Banks pulled out the gun? I see him running, and I see people against those lockers and people running that way, and I just ran the other way. Did, uh, did you know who you had struck when you shot it? I shot it like at his, like towards his back. After you did that, after you pulled the trigger and goes bang, shot goes off, what do you do? I ran. The sound of the shot and panic that followed was recorded on another student's cell phone. That recording is part of the court file. No. Banks was arraigned earlier this month on several charges. He will be tried as an adult. The intended target told police he thought he gave Banks a real $100 bill. Banks will be tried as an adult. He's due back in court for a pretrial hearing on January 8th. Steve Bergen, WLKY News. Thank you, Steve. Now, here's a little more. Along with assault and want endangerment, Banks is charged with unlawful possession of a firearm on school property, carrying a concealed weapon, tampering with evidence, and possession of a 